Ah, we got a revolver! Dude, that thing is clean. Little 22 maybe. Most expensive knife in America right there. Some sort of shotgun, little pump shotgun. Oh, it's something in a bag. Oh, is it a revolver? Bro, what? What's up guys, welcome back to another video today. We're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing, but first, we are on our way to the scrap yard. We are unloading our trailer. We got another full trailer. We filled up the trailer a lot faster this time than it took us last time, so that is a really, really good sign. Take y'all's guess down in the comments on how much weight you think we got today. 1,520 pounds is my guess. I will pick this back up once we get to the scrap yard. On a scale. Final chances to take a guess at the weight. Y'all take a guess down in the comments. Yes. Oh my God. All empty. Let's go get our weight. Our final weight total is... 1300 pounds so it's kind of like right in between i said 1550 emmy said 1200 so i guess emmy was closer price of scrap metal went up though i do gotta say we got 124 dollars for that that's a lot more than usual like a lot more than just like that we got some money for the clean stream fund baby gas budget for the week now we're off to go do some magnet fishing and fill the trailer up again i am not liking these logs Oh, it is not very deep here. We're gonna try to be extra careful about these logs. Yeah, all right, I'm gonna give a couple throws on this side. Too many sticks on the other side. Emmy's got a chair over there, so she's got a couple things. All right, let's see what we got here. What is it? It is a, oh, it's a for sale sign. We got a for sale sign to a house. I don't think it's sold. <laughs> Remax, Kirchnagshanana, right there, man. I don't think his house sold, or maybe he sold it and he congratulated, or he celebrated by throwing something in the river. All right, well, first find of the day right there. All right, well, I think we're gonna go ahead to a new spot. The only thing, literally the only thing I got was that for a sale sign for a house and Emmy got two chairs, so. First find in the trailer. Starting the next load off, pretty good action. With the two chairs, <laughs> looks like this bridge was born in 2002 there's just as many sticks over oh look at all the turtles oh my gosh there were so many turtles there all right well this is the side with the least amount of sticks there we go this feels heavier it is not a stick all right well we got something right here oh we got a couple things just a bunch of little scraps all right i'm gonna bring my bucket over here well emmy's got something big already on her first throw over here huge pipe look at that that's some good weight right there yeah you weren't lying this thing is pretty heavy Oh my gosh, yeah, that's a cast iron pipe. All right, cool. Well, at least we got a couple things here already right off the rip. Emmy's been finding some good stuff today already. Bro, y'all magnet fishing? Yeah. Oh shit. You got like a YouTube channel or something? Yeah, man. Yep, you too. That's like when you like when the waiter comes out and says enjoy your food and you say you too. Well, you know what? No, I wish I got. I hope that guy has fun. Well, we got a trot line again. I'm pretty sure we got this little trot line. Look, it's all set up. It's not even that old. Throw that in the bucket. Well, I had something else. Big old plate of metal right there. <laughs> Come out. That's heavy, dude. Get that off. There we go. Finally got something. It's been a little slow for me today, but it's okay. Not a lot of stuff, but it's heavy stuff. Then that's okay. Whoa, about lost the leg. <laughs> We're going to a new bridge. We got a couple things. Nothing, nothing crazy. We're looking for a better spot. This water definitely has gone down a substantial amount. It's about time. It looks like a knife. No, that's not a knife. Man, all that. We're on this super sketchy bridge for nothing. I'm gonna go try the other side. Look at that. We got a stroller or a chair. I don't know. Ah, this one was right on the bank. A little bit of sight magnet fishing right there. It looks like just some sort of lawn. Yeah, it's a lawn chair. It says Ozark Trail on it all right well i'm just getting my butt handed me the last few days here we got the chair that's about the only thing we got here oh finally oh my gosh i got something holy crap i don't even care what it is it's been forever since i found something it's a little piece of metal got something right here nope it just came off oh it's a signpost i think i got it what is that oh it's like a makeup mirror or something i don't know exactly what that is cool we finally got something decent today man that takes a lot of shoulder workout to get that thing because i don't know if y'all can tell but 
there's more metal down there so this entire bridge is like magnetic which is making this whole process very difficult oh yeah we got something all the way out there it's actually a really good weight coming we got it oh let's go baby i told you it's a good weight we got a revolver oh that thing looks fresh man holy cow let's go baby <laughs> We got a freaking revolver dude that thing is clean look at the handle on that baby still intact i literally said i'm like oh it's a good weight now the hammer doesn't still pull back we got a revolver we actually haven't found a revolver in a while r.g i don't know what that is but we'll take it man that kind of makes me feel a little bit better on how today is going now i thought we did it back to back i got really excited looks like a knife of some sort oh no that's a piece of a safe or uh yeah that's like a lock box like a p.o box or a safe lock right there cool man that's like where the key would go and you twist it we may be uncovering something here let's see what do we got oh it's another one of those like lock things like a safety deposit box at a bank or uh like a p.o box at a mail store post office oh my gosh dude why can i think of the word post office to save my life speaking about p.o boxes me blake emmy and bobby just opened up a p.o box if y'all want to send us some stuff to open up on a live stream uh we're gonna try to do a live stream every other saturday opening up stuff that is sent to the p.o box so if you guys want to send something there's the p.o box up on the screen or i'll have it linked down in the description as well feels just a little bit more heavy is it another one of those square things no it's not what is this weird looking just a piece of scrap metal I'm getting a little pile going here i'm gonna throw a little bit to my left oh what do we got here oh that's a gun oh my gosh that was a gun it just fell back in the water i didn't see what it was until it was falling there's a rifle down there it's literally got to be straight down all right i got something please be it let's go we got it all right i'm going very slow it fell off and i got it back oh let's go it's a rifle oh my gosh i did not like that <laughs> i thought we lost it man gun number two baby i'm throwing this back out there oops well i had something on there little 22 maybe super old all right and then we also got a piece of what i assume is the bridge here it's like a graded bridge it's weird oh yeah we got a little something here i'm pretty sure this long stick thing is one that was on when i threw it i just had no idea no idea what that is it almost looks like some sort of weird fan blade also if you guys would like to get into there we go right on cue oh no it came off well if you guys would like to get into magnet fishing go check out battlemagnets.us the link's down in the description we got something and it's just some scrap all right we'll take it all right well we got a ton of like welding rods and nails all right nothing too crazy yet oh what is this we got some sort of box whoa it's just barely on there it looks like a nail clipper box kind of go slow go slow oh we got it what the heck is this man it's some sort of box it says whale is that nail clippers pretty sure whale is some sort of like nail clippers three two one whoa plastic. that is plastic bubble what wrap? the heck it's like bubble wrap oh yeah look at that i'm pretty sure it is nail clippers oh. it's like a whole grooming kit yeah there's a mirror <laughs> what's up y'all <laughs> It's a razor. It's a razor. <laughs> yeah, look at all the different attachments. Why does someone get rid of that now? It's like brand new too. This is like, it's still in a plastic bag. All right, well, we'll keep that. That's a really cool find right there. Dang it, I was hoping that was like a Glock case and there's gonna be a Glock in there. We'll get them next time. Someone don't rob the barbershop. What are you? This thing's got some, oh, it's another signpost. Got it, woo! There we go, baby, two for two on the signpost. We're getting some goodies, man. This is a perfect example of magnet fishing though. Sometimes it takes a while to find the right bridge, but once you find the right bridge i mean as you can see you start finding some cool stuff it's all about just driving around till you find a good spot i'd say about 80 percent of my day of magnet fishing is trying to find a spot all right i'm about to go take a few throws on the other side here see if the other side's any good well we know this side was good i even got a little something on this throw too is it a little can top oh yeah just a little bit of a can top oh yeah i got something on the first throw on this side on the first throw on this side what is it oh it's more of that great stuff for the bridge dang this thing's got some weight Whew. that's that great for the bridge right there man heck yeah dude that's gonna add up i bet you there's probably gonna be a bunch of that down there we got a it's a circle what the heck oh my gosh that's the biggest bridge donut i've ever seen holy crap we got a world record bridge donut right here jeez it's like the size of my hand what the heck this thing's like no i just caught the damn bridge is that a gun in a holster oh my gosh Woo! all right it's not oh my gosh dude that was so scary 
I don't know what this is. It looked like a gun in a holster, kind of. This sucker's on there good, though. All right, well, we got this thing. That was a very scary moment. I thought we lost it. Hey, there we go. We got ourselves a little fork action going on. I did feel something pretty big out there, but I just want to be careful that I don't get my magnet snagged. Just because I know there's a lot of sticks around here. What do we got? We got a another gun. Let's go, baby. Gun number three and a knife. Do we got a gun and a knife on this one throw here? Oh my gosh, it's a shotgun. Let's go, baby. And a Cutco knife. The $3,000 Cutco knife. Most expensive knife in America right there. Gun number three at this spot so far. Some sort of shotgun, little pump shotgun. Definitely has seen better days. Still a really good find though. That was all the way out there. One of these days we're gonna go two for two again. I've gone two for two a couple times, but not recently. Look at there, another pipe. Oh, it just squirted everywhere. And we also got this little tiny circle. Man, did this day turn around. We are getting our teeth kicked in for the first half of the day. But I mean, that's just how it goes, man. Ah, this is probably the heaviest thing of the day. Oh, it's just a circle. Come here, get away. Got stuck to the bridge. It's a plate magnet like that big and it got stuck to the bridge. Not, not good. Oh my gosh, I got it. Bro, what is this thing? Oh, this thing's so heavy. I don't know what it is, but it weighs like freaking 30 pounds. It's not a magnet. I got no idea. I got no idea what that is, honestly. What are you? We got a can, some sort of old can. Whatever this thing is, a prober. I don't know what that is, but we'll take it. It looks like some big thing. Just a little piece of it. Woo! All shoulders today, baby. All shoulders today. <laughs> we are getting a big pile of stuff here. This is good, filling up the trailer. What do we got? Oh, oh, it's something in a bag. No way, I think we got another gun, dude. It's in a bag. Yes, sir. That's gotta be a gun. It's a gun, baby. It's a gun in a bag. Gun number four. Let's go, dude. I always love finding guns in bags. What are we working with here, baby? What are we working with? Oh man, I think this is a revolver. Let's bust it open here. Oh, is it a revolver? Yeah. Yeah, but there's hot sauce. Bro, what? That's that awesome. looks like blood, bro. No. What? Oh, oh my gosh, dude. Oh, it's it's ketchup packets. It's ketchup packets on the gun. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it looked like blood though. I'm not even gonna lie. Who's throwing away their ketchup packets like that? Dude, look. It looks like there's blood on the gun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy crap. All right, this one's still functional. I can't tell if it's loaded. I got to see if this is loaded now. I didn't think it was going to cock back. I'm well aware I should not have checked to see if it was still functional by cocking it back. Have not found very many revolvers, but we've been finding a bunch of things. Dude, the ketchup is like, what? Was that a bloody gun that we just found? Oh shoot, we almost lost the bucket. That was almost really not good. I'm just saying the blood right there, that is really weird. It looks empty, but I can't see the one that I need to see is the problem. I don't think there's a bullet in there. Then again, I don't know. We're just gonna be extremely, extremely cautious. No bullets in any of the cylinders, but I can't check the one I need to check. We're just gonna be very careful with that one. The ketchup is, is making me really like wonder just what the hell. <laughs> I don't understand. It's a burger murder. I think someone just like probably had like a bag that they got some food in in their car and they're just looking for the closest bag that they could find to throw it away. It just had ketchup in it, I suppose. Some Hunt's ketchup. Little piece of rebar. Some murder rebar, man. Got just a little something on there. What is this? Oh, it's like a broom handle. No, it's not a broom handle. I thought it was, but it's like some sort of bracket looking thing. There we go. It's got some good weight coming right here. Dang it, I lost it. It was a piece of a pipe. It's so hard with this bridge, man. Oh my gosh, this is even heavier than the last thing. There ain't no way, bro. Ah! Oh my gosh, what is that? Oh, that was all shoulders because of the bridge. Oh my gosh. I literally pulled it like straight arm this thing up. I got the strongest shoulders in the world, man. Ain't no one can tell me I can't. At least 60 pounds. It's about the same size as a 45 plate at the gym. It ain't 45 pounds. That thing's way heavier. Can anyone tell me what the heck this thing is? I'd say this spot is certified loaded. <laughs> Come here. Whoa, oh, it's an umbrella. <laughs> All right, dude, I thought it was like something weird wrapped in a bag. What the heck is this thing, dude? Oh, I think it's another piece of that thing. This looks like this could be a piece of a car. Well, here's this one. Not nearly as heavy as that one is. It's also a 
lot smaller. I think they might be the same thing. I don't know, man. We need Blake here. Here's a plate of metal, and I don't think it's gonna, dude, there's something, there's rope tied to this metal plate. This weight holding something down to the bottom. Oh, I've seen too many movies, man. Please don't be a body, dude. Oh. Do I wanna pull this up? I'm gonna go down there. I gotta wait for Emmy though, dude. All right, I'm gonna figure out a way to get down here. I'm really getting sketched out now, I don't like this. Oh, dude, I'm really not feeling too good about this. <laughs> Is that a boat? What the hell? Dude, there's a boat right there. Dude, there's a boat. All right, anyways, I'm getting distracted here. It came off. Whatever this thing is tied to, this person did not want to come back up. I don't know how I feel. There's something on this rope. There's something on this rope here. Oh my gosh, oh, it's a fishnet. Damn, that scared me, bro. It's a fishnet. Look at it. This is lost. I don't know. That's not what I had though. Here, I'm just gonna tie it up up here. All right, well, we're just gonna tie this right here just in case it wasn't a lost net. I still am getting really, really bad vibes from that. I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna get it tomorrow. Once we come back, we got some more manpower. We should be able to just muscle it up, but whatever is sunk down there with that rope, someone did not want coming back up, so. And with all the guns we found here too, I, I, I just don't got good vibes at the moment. <laughs> Dang, man, 1961. If you made that nine and 18, this bridge would be just as old as Blake. I don't know if this is the same one. The MSRP on this gun right here is $1,500. What? If this is the same gun that I'm looking at, it looks like the same exact gun. It says right there, Smith & Wesson point three three seven magnum one thousand five hundred and thirty nine dollars i think that might be the most expensive gun that i found and it's a revolver and it's the worst and that is gonna wrap up today's video thank you all so much for watching all the way to the end if you guys have made it all the way to the end of the video comment revolver down in the comments this is by far one of the best guns that we have found in a really really long time it ended up being worth quite a bit of money which i'm very very happy about anyways i will catch y'all tomorrow peace